What's up everyone, Jason back here with another diecast review tonight. We'll be taking a look at the 2018 Ricky Stenhouse Jr. Number 17 Fastenal Ford for Roush Fenway Racing. Before I get to the diecast itself, let's take a look at the packaging. On top here we have your traditional 2018 driver profile image featuring Ricky Stenhouse's name, Roush Fenway Racing, Action Racing Collectibles in number 17, and 124 scale stock car limited edition adult collectible. Side of the box here features Ricky Stenhouse Jr. 2018 artist rendering of the car, standard finish, and Lionel Racing branding on the bottom. Moving along to the end of the box here, we have 2018 NASCAR hologram, Action Racing collectibles, and Action Racing branding on the bottom. S side of the box here features some more Action branding on top and details on what you can expect on a 124 scale ARC die cast for the 2018 season and beyond. And then to the other end here, we have Roush Fenway Racing, Standard Finish 17, and Ricky Stenhouse Jr. Simulated Signature Action Branding. And of course, the production sticker up top there that says Ricky Stenhouse Jr. Number 17, Fest and All 2018 Fusion, one of 577 produced. Mine is a seer, den number 335. So didn't get too low of a production number on mine, but eh, I'm not too keen on getting, you know, it's not important to me on getting low productions. All right, here it is, the Fastenal Ford for 2018 of Ricky Stenhouse Jr. It's a really good looking die cast. This is the autographed version. So let's start off on the front. We have Ford Fusion, number 17. Of course, Rush Fenway Racing down there. Fastenal on the hood. Ricky Stenhouse Jr.'s autograph on the front windshield along with the Monster Energy branding and Ford logos on both sides of that. Go ahead and open up the hood for you. If I can get it to open. Lionel makes the hoods on these cars really hard to open now. But there's your engine detail inside there. Inside of the hood we have powered by Ford, Fastenal, and Canon. For contingencies on the front nose, we have Moog, Molly Comp Camp, Edelbrock, and Sunoco. Goodyear above both front tires. Car, of course, features working steering with yellow painted lug nuts, aero race wheel decals, and of course, you can see detail behind that even with brake rotors and calibers. Of course, for contingencies on the door here, we have the Monster Energy NASCAR Cup Series logo, Mechanicwear 3M, Canon, and Flowmaster with NASCAR race car up there on the A post. 17 on the door with the yellow arrow pointing down where the jack stop goes. As you can tell, this is a matte finish. Really good looking car. Probably one of the best looking Stenhouse cars I've seen him drive that was sponsored by Fastenal. Of course, behind that for contingencies on the door, we have Mac Tools, Champion Spark Plugs, and International Trucks. Fastenal on the quarter panel along with the American Ethanol Fuel Filler. We have Ford Drive 1 Fastenal, 5th 3rd Bank on the B post, of course Stenhouse Jr. up on the roof rail, 17 on the roof and Fastenal as your roof sponsor, functioning roof flaps of course. Back on the rear window we have Stenhouse Jr. and of course the den number as I mentioned earlier, 335. Here on the deck lid we do have Fastenal. Rear bumper cover features Rush Fenway Racing, Ford, Fastenal, and the 17. Right side of the car is basically the same, except we got the exhaust detail or lack thereof on the rocker panel. But other than that, it is identical to the right or left side. Here's the bottom of the car. As I mentioned, working steering, but it's plastic chassis. There's your roof cam up there. So yeah, it's a great looking die cast. I highly recommend picking this up. You can get multiple versions of this through Plan B sales, autographed, non-autographed, special finishes. It's available and it's a good looking car if you're a Stenhouse fan. I know there's some of you out there who do enjoy and are collecting Ricky Stenhouse Jr. die cast, so. This one's for you. I highly recommend picking it up. If you are interested in picking one of these up for your collection, I will post some links in the description box below. So be sure to check that out. 
Thanks for watching. If you have yet to subscribe, click the subscribe button. I highly appreciate it. Click the bell for notifications. You can also follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at JasonAStrain69. I post new diecast reviews every Monday and sometimes throughout the week I'll post a random review. So be sure to click that bell and follow me on social media. So thanks for watching. Have a great night, everyone. See you next week for an all new diecast review. Bye.